In this video, I'm going to show you how to enable JD Link for machines within your organization. JD Link is a no added cost connectivity service that connects your equipment to your operation center organization and can be opted into or out of at any time. From the John Deere Operation Center homepage, select the setup drop down to manage connections, files, and other settings relating to your equipment and operation. Select the Terminals link at the bottom to give you an overview of all terminals accessible through your organisation. Once you navigate through to the Terminals page, you are able to view all connected machines with the ability to filter these results by utilising the drop-down shown on the left-hand column. To display information relating to a terminal, simply click the terminal serial number and an overview of the information relating to this terminal will be displayed. Once loaded, you will be able to see the JD-Link connectivity status of the machine under the connectivity heading. Providing you have contract acceptance permissions with the organisation, you will be able to enable or disable JD-Link connectivity. If you are unable to view what is shown on screen, you will need to obtain access via the owner of the organisation. To enable, press Enable JD-Link Connectivity. This will bring up equipment details and your current subscription status. Once you have read through the details, press next. The terms and conditions should then be read, the box checked to agree, and then you can proceed by pressing accept. Finally, the automatic enrollment page allows you to have terminals automatically enrolled to JD Link as they are added to your organization. Alternatively, as machines are added, you can manually enroll them to JD Link as I have just shown. Clicking done will finalize the JD Link enablement process. Following the same process can allow you to disable equipment JD-Link connectivity. Now we're going to set up and review DataSync on your Generation 4 display. DataSync utilises your JD-Link connection to stream work data from the display to the John Deere Operation Centre every 30 seconds. You can also remotely view your screen in real time from your laptop, phone or tablet and review near real-time machine metrics such as location, hours, fuel level and much more. On your Generation 4 display, the status centre at the top of your screen is the first indicator of your machine's current connection to the operation centre. The cloud symbol indicates that the connection is active, whilst the arrow indicates active streaming of data. Press on the status bar to give you more information, where the light indicator shows the status of your connection. Pressing on the data sync area of the status center takes you to the data sync pop-up where you can review your operation center connection where it is currently shown as active. To get more information on your data connection, press on diagnostics where you can confirm cellular signal strength and ensure all requirements are met to enable data sync. If any of the requirements aren't met, it will be shown here with an exclamation mark. Return to the data sync pop-up where any unsent data will be displayed at the bottom of the screen. The sync preferences allow you to toggle automatic data transfer of work data on and off. Thanks for watching and be sure to check out our other how-to videos.